Hello friends, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365 and today I'm going to review the Blu-ray edition of Robin Williams in Popeye. If you're new to the channel, please hit the like button, subscribe, hit that bell notification. You can also find me over Twitter, Instagram, and Letterboxd at MovieGuy365. Okay, finally, after years of wanting this one on Blu-ray, Robert Altman's Popeye is now here, and this movie means a lot to me. I have been a huge fan of the movie since I was little. It's really just one of those catchy kind of musicals and comedies and a little bit of action thrown in, great characters. And really just, it was the first movie I ever saw with Robin Williams. It was also one of the first VHS tapes uh, my father had in his collection. So this one got constant rewatch on that format. And it's really kind of staggering. This has not appeared on Blu-ray before now. This is 2020 going on 2021. And this is now just appearing. So this is cool. We got it. It's better late than never, I suppose. Uh, but yeah, I love this movie dearly. It really has just... A, a permanent place in my heart. It's really good, and you know, I'm just I'm I'm glad it's here. So, all right, we're gonna talk about the picture quality and audio in just a moment. But first, let's do a quick unboxing. Okay, we have the Blu-ray edition of Popeye finally available on Blu-ray. Uh, I preferred the poster art that was in, in the initial artwork for this uh, Blu-ray, but this is okay. It's just uh, not perfect in my opinion, but it's all right. Uh, then we have the back cover and the spine. And then interior-wise, very basic. It's pretty much as basic as a Blu-ray interior artwork can go. So, all right, now let's talk about the picture quality and the audio. Popeye on Blu-ray has a 239 aspect ratio, and as far as the look of the film goes, it does have a nice amount of film grain to it. It looks appropriate, and it doesn't appear that Paramount applied any kind of DNR or softening to the image. So it has a nice filmic look to it, and in that regard, I think it looks really, really nice. Now for the rest of the film, uh, the movie, movie itself has kind of like a, you know, neutral kind of a color tone, a little bit muted. Sweet Haven itself has a town, a lot of browns and grays and just the overall atmosphere of the town itself is just kind of appropriately mute. But when it comes to the costuming in particular, let's say Popeye's outfit, olive oils, sweet peas, uh, it pops with a natural color boost, and I think overall it has a nice rendering, and it really stands out from the rest of the town. I think it was meant to do so, and here on Blu-ray, it actually looks really good. I will say black levels in particular are really well done. No real elevation to speak of. I was uh, kind of fearful of a few moments that I knew uh, from going into the movie that would be like that. But the 1080p image does not disappoint in that area, so yes, black levels are rendered well. Level of detail is also good. Uh, once again, just the overall up close shots, I think in particular, are really nice. Uh, you know, skin textures, they look good, and costuming is, is appropriate. And overall, just the, the well detailedness of Sweet Haven itself comes out really nicely on 1080p. Popeye on Blu-ray looks really good. It, it has a very filmic look to it, nice and natural color pop is appropriate, and overall, just the look of the film is very nice. Popeye on Blu-ray supports the DTS 5.1, and this being a musical, it definitely does not disappoint in that area. Sweet Haven as a town and the uh, overall setting of the film lends itself very well to a surround sound environment. Everything from a bell ringing to a seagull in the background or the creaking in the, in the uh, waves of the ocean, it all is rendered very well. It's a very atmospheric sound experience, pretty consistent throughout the movie, definitely worthwhile. Uh, dialogue coming through the center channel, even with Popeye muttering to himself, comes through clean and clear, very easy to understand. The front channels, they handle a lot of the action throughout the movie and they do so very well. And once again, the surround sound environment is, I, I feel, very strong here. It's a very environmental, atmospheric audio experience. The LFE is probably the weakest aspect here. It's not very aggressive. It kicks in from time to time, usually when a boat's rumbling or something, boat engine, uh, that kind of thing. But for the most part, it's just kind of in the background. It kicks in when it needs to. It's just not a heavy presence. The DTS 5.1 for the movie is really good. Uh, Popeye sounds great on Blu-ray and you won't be disappointed. For Popeye on Blu-ray, I'm gonna give the picture quality a B plus. I think it has a nice filmic look to it. Colors pop when they need to. Black levels are really nicely rendered and there's a good amount of detail. 
For the audio presentation, I'm going to give Popeye on Blu-ray a B plus as well. It's a musical. It sounds really good. It fills the room nicely when those musical moments do kick in. But when they don't, there's a lot of atmosphere to enjoy. And everything that is prioritized up front sounds very clean and clear. So that is my review of Popeye on Blu-ray. Let me know in the comment section below if you're a fan of the movie. And if you picked up the Blu-ray, what did you think of it? In the meantime, please like, subscribe, hit that bell notification. So until next time, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. I will see you at the movies.